Welcome to Clarinet Lesson 1. In this lesson, you will learn how to assemble and how to hold the clarinet. To help me with that, here's my friend Kevin. Hi! To keep your clarinet safe, start with the case on the floor. Open up the case, and now let's take a look at some of the parts. You have the bell, the barrel joint, or just barrel, the upper joint, the lower joint, and the mouthpiece. There are different ways to put your clarinet together, but let's start with the bell. Attach it to the lower joint like this. Be careful not to squeeze any of the keys or rods. Now take the upper joint and connect it to the lower joint here. Again, be careful not to squeeze any of the keys or rods as you work them together. You will know that they are lined up when the keys in the front make a straight line. You can also check the alignment on the side of the clarinet using the upper key mechanism and lower key mechanism here. Now attach the barrel, making sure that the wider portion is on the bottom. You are almost done assembling your clarinet. Next take the mouthpiece and work it onto the top. Make sure that the opening faces the back of the clarinet. If any of the pieces are hard to put together, then you will have to put cork grease on them, and we'll show you that later. The final step in assembling your clarinet is the reed. Take it out of its case. Be careful when sliding it onto the back of the mouthpiece. Lift the ligature. Slide the reed into place, being careful not to touch the tip because you might break it. When you tighten the screws, only put a little bit of tension. If you tighten them too much, it might break the ligature. If you look closely, you will see that this reed has been placed too low on the mouthpiece and this time it's been placed too high. You can tell when you turn it over and see the reed sticking out over the top of the mouthpiece. What you want to see is a little bit of the black mouthpiece over the reed like this. As you can see, this reed has a chip and will need to be replaced. Finally, close your case and slide it under your chair so that it is safe and out of the way. When holding your clarinet, place your right thumb under the thumb rest, right at the knuckle. Your front fingers are placed here, one, two, three. Your left thumb covers the hole in the back here, and your front fingers cover the holes here, here, and here. When playing the clarinet, sit forward in your chair with your feet flat on the floor, sitting up tall with no slouching. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for lesson two.